What's up everybody, welcome to Louis Marcos. I salute you whatever you are. Needless to present this gentleman right here, Mr. Big Ron himself, eight time Mr. Olympia record holder in that discipline, unparalleled physique development until today. I just posted a video which I enjoy you and I commend you to watch it. The link would be at the bottom. It is on my Facebook fan page where he speaks, where he started using the stuff. What stuff I'm talking about? Stuff that he calls vitamin K, vitamin G, vitamin S, and vitamins in a sense, right? So to speak. Now, needless to say, the dude has a big brand company now, so he needs to speak in a politically correct way, and that I respect. Anyway, you guys know him, and he says clearly that before 1995, he was natural, i.e. he never used those kind of vitamins I was speaking of, and some of you guys cannot believe that. Why? Because in 1994, uh, actually, he competed in Mr. Olympia, the biggest bodybuilding show ever, and he was able to place 15. Well, now 15 is the last place, but at least he was there. Now, I'm not talking about this condition right here. This was later where he has using that stuff. What he says, though, is that in 1995 in Paris, he met Flex Wheeler and he told him, straight up, bro, what the hell are you using? I need to use that stuff, right? And Flex Wheeler told him straight up, bro, I'm using this and that and that. So he started using the so-called vitamins after 1995 and he started to rocket in his career. As you guys know, he won versus Flex Wheeler himself, a genetic freak. He won versus him in 1996 uh, Canadian Grand Prix, if I'm not mistaken. And after that, he never looked back. He won the Mr. O in 98 and the rest is history. Eight Mr. O's in a row. Now, let's take a look at the pictures of him prior to 1995. And do I believe that he was natural? Straight up, straight up. Louis Marco says that Ronnie Coleman was absolutely vitamin free prior to 1995. Uh, I guarantee you that. I 100% believe him. There is no reason for him to lie. And I'll give you a reason a concrete reason why a little bit later. So this what you're looking at is a 100% natural muscular development on this dude. I'm not saying you can achieve it you and me mere mortals, but this dude has a crazy, stupendous, humongously good genetic baggage that he can allow him to reach this level. What you're looking at is a dude that never use vitamins. I can put my hand on fire for that, right? I guarantee you he was natural here. Now, uh, my alibi and my reason me saying this is another dude of the 80s, namely Mr. Jean-Paul Guillaume. Let me find him. Dude right here. He's standing next to an IFBB pro, Mike Ashley. Mike Ashley was also claiming a natural status. But let's concentrate on GP Guillaume, an ex Mr. Universe. Dude right here, I guarantee you he too was natural. Hence, he was asking independent testers outside of the IFBB. He was saying, guys, come and test me whenever you wish, off season, during contest time. And they, they, they did. Never was he caught using any kind of vitamin S, if you know what I mean. He was 100% natural and look at the muscular development he was having back then in the 80s crazy arms and peak development even by today's standard what you're looking at is a 100 percent natural dude look him up on youtube jean paul guillaume as far as i know he is still a trainer and today very healthy so that goes to show guys genetic freaks do happen i repeat genetic freaks do happen and if these guys add uh, some vitamin S, or vitamin G, if you know what I mean, to their crazy genetic development, that will create monsters like freaking the, the, those top IFBB pros like Roni uh, Coleman. I mean, look at Arnold Schwarzenegger, right? I mean, he clearly said that he uses, he used actually steroids, but even if people use those kind of steroids or even stronger ones, do you know another person who was able to replicate freaking this? Are you kidding me? Never do we see such a crazy muscular development upstairs. This, I mean, there is no steroid that can make your, your chest look this big. He is so 
uh, I mean, uh, efficiently developed up there is just insane. Look at the arm while keeping a totally small, tiny waist. Sinful, not even once, bro. I mean, nobody is able to replicate this until today, right? This is it goes through the genetic is the I mean the, the craziest factor. But even with that, in the video that I enjoy you to watch, Ronnie Coleman clearly said that uh, he did not know. Now he knows that this is the way to win, right? He's talking about the uh, famous uh, uh, vitamins that he had to use, and then. So sure enough, when he used those vitamins, it created this kind of freakish, uh, most muscular bodybuilder we've ever seen until today, right? So that's it, guys. And uh, just to close this video, there's another freak that is coming uh, these days, making some waves in the IFBB, namely uh, this dude right here, Big Ramy. Now, here, look at him. I think he was natural here. And here he's using those kind of vitamins. Of course, he became a master, master freak. We will see in the future if he has what it takes to reach this level though, right? If he can be this shredded like Jay Cutler, he will be a force to be reckoned with and in my opinion, nobody can stop him. Don't forget to like the video if you agree about Ronnie Coleman was natural vitamin free prior to 1994. I salute you wherever you are. Have a nice one.